Bro, what are you doing? Supposed to be filming a. Bro, what are you? For a shoe vid, so I, I guess it's time. I guess it's time. So I think mine's solid. I think my shoe collection is solid. Like you have some hype shit, and then you have some like you know just calm. You can just wear anywhere. All right, guys. Well, step into the closet. Ride with me if you ride with me, you can slide with me if you feel like 550 on the fast stick. You can get high with me. That's a deal, right? Ride with me if you ride with me, you can slide with me if you feel like. 550 on the fast stick, you can get high with me. That's a deal, right? That's a deal. All right, so here we are in my closet. Um, so we're gonna do, we're gonna do this in sections. I have some shoes at the top. I got some shoes over here. This is more the common area, and then I have the 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 hype section over here. So I will, we'll get to that. So I guess we'll start off. I got a couple bags and shit. You know what I'm saying? But I, I guess we'll start off. Uh, with the sandals, you know, I, I rock the Yeezy slides. They're the most comfortable slides I've ever had. I got some Gucci ones, but I don't really wear those too much because they're they're like rocks. You're, you're walking with rocks. My Air Maxes, which I wear to the gym pretty much every day. I have some Vapor Maxes I wear to the gym occasionally. And then I got these Polo uh, runners that Polo sent over when we were doing our um, shoot for them. Shout out to Polo. Thank you so much. Y'all showed amazing love. But um, I guess we'll, we'll start here. One of the most iconic shoes ever, your Air Force Ones. You gotta have multiples of these. I have multiples. I have a pair I can just slip on and go anywhere. And then I have a pair where if I wanna go out, I can put those on. So Air Force One, gotta have them. Gotta have multiple pairs. You know, Air Max 90s, nothing nothing crazy. Uh, you got your, your neutral, I think these are called neutral colors. I don't know, your tans or whatever. None, none special. So we're just gonna kind of fly through these. We got these. Michigan Dunks, nothing special, great colorway, and I, I had to pick them up. I like them. Pretty sure these are the Supreme Air Forces. A little beat up, you know, but nothing too crazy. Like I said, you gotta have a couple of them. Get to the Yeezys. Yeah. Uh, Zebra 350s. These are one of like the first shoes I I got with like Twitch money. Well, one of them was the Air Jordan 1s. I bought these off of my boy Turbo. Shout out to my man Turbo. He always he always hooks it up when he can. What are these? They're in a slide box. I don't know why. Uh, the Wave Runners. Clean shoe, clean shoe. Haven't worn these too much, but I actually need to start. This is actually one of my favorite pairs of Jordans that I own. And um, these are the Aminaire 3s. Now with these... These were only in women's sizes, so it was kind of uh, tough to find them. And when I did, I put them on, they fit. I was like, yeah, I, I gotta get these. So these Aminaire threes are one of my favorites in my collection. Nike Dunks. Uh, these are the Undefeateds. Uh, there's two or three pairs of the Undefeateds. I have two pairs of them. Uh, these are the obviously the, the brown ones with the lime green. What do we got here? I don't even know what color the way these are. We're just calling them the, the Laker Dunks. I mean, wh why wouldn't you? These are, you know, I kind of fucked up when I got these. I got them in a size too small and they hurt my feet when I wear them for a really long time. So I haven't worn them in a cool minute. Ooh, I know what these are. These are the Bruce Lee Kobe's that I, I have yet to touch. I have, I have not worn these dead stock. Still smell brand new, and I will never wear these just, just out of respect. I have another pair of Kobe's that I do wear to hoop in. These are the Independence Day, if I believe, the Independence Day Kobe's that I do wear to hoop. These are kind of kind of B. I kind of ran these into the ground. Rest in peace, Kobe. We'll get to the more common area. This is where a lot of my Jordans are. You got your, sorry if I misname these. I'm pretty sure these are Sport Blue 3s. Uh, you got your Cardinal 3s right here. Dope shoe, dope colorway. We'll go down here to the Muslin 3s. Haven't worn these yet, I need to though. Black Cement 3s, tough shoe, tough shoe. I bought these off of Jay for a steal. Right, Saf? Mm -hmm. I think I gave him like 250 for these. And they were like hardly worn. I mean, they got they got a couple scuffs and stuff like that, but like 250, come on, dude. You need to learn your prices, kid. No, I just picked these up. Military fours. I really love this colorway. You can't go wrong with a black, white, and gray, you know, shoe. 
So I had to pick those up. What the fours? Sav had these first and I was like, damn, these are kind of hard. So you can see in a Nuke Squad video, uh, we went to Cool Kicks. We all picked some shoes out and I, I grabbed these. I went and grabbed these. So if you guys don't know about sneakers or shoes, so the What the Fours are special because you got your, your different colorways, your Oreos down here, your breads, your military blues and the tongue and the heel, uh, your Oreos on this side, and then it's just a bunch of different colorways in, in this one shoe, this one pair of shoe. Got the Oreo Fours. See, like, you got the Oreo fours right here in this area, uh, but these are just Oreo fours. Uh, shout out to the one of uh, BJ's friends that plugged us with these. And then I believe these are called the Crimson fours. I have yet to wear these, but looking at them right now, I do kind of like the way they looked before. Uh, I didn't really like them at first when I bought them, but I might have to wear those. So these are my first pair of uh, high top 11s. Gotta have the cool gray. Cool gray is an elite colorway, OG colorway. It's, it's a real nice shoe. Then we'll move to the ones. I haven't worn these yet, but these are the Hyper Royal ones. And then we can move on to the University Blues. Uh, originally, they come with black laces. I changed them to the whites uh, just because I feel like they look better with the white ones. Got these uh, Midnight Navy Blue Sixes that I just picked up like a couple weeks ago. Um, not a huge fan of sixes, but a white with with a dark blue. I mean, it just it just looks right on on anything pretty much you wear. Then we have the Carmine Sixes. Shout out to Buya. Buya got me these uh, during Christmas time. And I, I think he chose a solid ass shoe. But he has got some good taste. And we got some low 11s, Legend Blue Lows. Gotta have these, great colorway, great shoe. Concord 11 Lows, great shoe. Love the colorway, black and white, can't go wrong with it. And then I recently picked these up, haven't got to wore them yet. These are 72 and 10 low 11s. Really nice shoe, leather is really nice on them. Quality's very good. These are the other undefeated dunks, the all black. Sav tried to buy these off of me a couple of times, but I said no, because I kind of like them. Then you got the overused, overplayed, overworn. The new Air Forces. The new Air Forces, the Panda Dunks. I mean, I don't blame them, Sav. I don't blame them. It's a good looking shoe. It's black and white. You pretty much wear with anything. I believe these were the first Dunks I've ever bought. And I bought these on StockX before they released. These are called the Free 99s. See it in there. But I just I just thought they were a cool shoe, you know? Different colors on different parts of the shoe. It's like almost like a, a what the dunk to me. And now, last but not least, we get to the heat. Steady going up like a travel plan. Homer Simpson face, lucky power plan. Yeah, I'm off that dope. Like I'm back again to visit at the Millie's. I don't club hers. Give the word if it's a city love for gimme. We got the Air Max 90 off white. I'm gonna just call these the sand dune ones. I don't know what the fuck their their real name is. Just reminds me of sand with this this military like tan colorway. It's kind of hard to get a, a fit with this kind of colorway. But um, I love the laces. I love the, the like the different color they chose for the laces and the and the Nike Switch. So sticking with the off white, we'll go up to one of my one of my favorite pairs of shoes in my collection, uh, the off white fours, the sales. Now with like the Omnir threes, uh, these are only in women's sizes only, and as you can see, I've pretty much worn these a lot because there's one of my favorite pair of shoes. I wear my shoes, okay? There's people that collect sneakers or shoes and don't wear their shit. Wear your shoes. But yeah, these are these are a really dope shoe, great colorway, and, I, and I, I just, I love those. And speaking about wearing your shoes, if there's anybody in the LA area that are willing to help me clean my shoes, hit my DMs, Instagram, Twitter, I'll be checking, all right? Those are those, those are the sales, off-whites. Then we'll go to the, the Chunky Dunks, Nike, uh, collabed with Ben & Jerry's with these and created the chunky dunk it's a dope shoe i believe all the shoes have a different print on them as far as like the cow print goes man if you if you have if you have the money i mean go and get you some chunky dunks the only thing i don't like about these you wear them one time they're gonna fucking crease but dope shoe all around staying on the dunks you got your union dunks there was three pairs of the unions that came out this was my favorite pair that came out i love this colorway there was uh like a, a pinkish kind of color that came out. And then there was one that was kind of like a Laker colorway, but 
I love these. I love the reflective kind of just like surface. Then we're gonna go over to one of my favorite pair of dunks that I have. These are the Travis Scott dunks. Very dope shoe, very unique. You got your bandana with your plaid. Then the, the my favorite thing about these shoes is the laces. The rope laces are, are so dope. They give you another pair of laces that you can change, but I just think these are so unique that you gotta leave these on. Another one of my favorite pairs of shoes that I have, these are the Air Jordan 1 Low Fragments. Uh, Travis Scott dropped these. He sends you like, not him personally, but I think Nike sends you three pairs of laces. I got the pink ones on right now. Uh, you can have an, like an off-white tannish color. Uh, I might put those back on because I really like that color. I'm probably gonna get the, the new ones that just released. I really like that colorway. So we'll see about that. The Sean Witherspoon Air Max 1s or 97s, I, I, I think. Like there's, I don't know what, I, I would just call them the Air Max 1s. Uh, very dope shoe. You got your corduroy uh, fabric, different colors. I don't know what the colors stand for. I'll probably look it up a little bit. So staying on the uh, Air Max 1s, we got these Air Max 1 Nike Concepts. I believe there was three pairs that came out, three different colorways, I, I, I should say. These were my favorite. Uh, I, I think I just love the bright colors. I love the purple and the denim. Then you got this like soft pink that I really love. It just sets the, the tone of the shoe. Then you got your, your bottom or whatever. And then you got a little, uh, I think this is like a guitar pick. It looks like a guitar pick to me, but I, I love them, I love them. Got another pair of dunks there. Nothing crazy, those are the Para dunks. Uh, very dope shoe, I've, I've only worn them a couple times. It's just hard to find a, an, an outfit for those. So now we're moving on to my more dressy, more fancy kind of shoes. Uh, you got the Dior Lowe's right here. I don't know the exact name, uh, but shout out to my man's Chris Swag. He bought me those for Christmas as well. Uh, great looking shoe, he has great taste, even though my, my shoe collection is, is better than him. He might have the most expensive pairs of shoes in the house, but I think my collection tops his. The Dior Lowe's, then we got the uh, red bottoms, of course. Shout out to my sugar mama, got me got me two pairs of red bottoms, and I'm, I'm not even joking, I'm not even joking. I didn't buy these, my sugar mama got these. Both of these that she got me are kind of like a limited edition. Uh, I don't think you can actually get these anymore in stores. The, the spikes, the red bottom, most uncomfortable pair of shoes that I've ever had. And then we got these ones that look like a fucking rock, but I, I love the colorway. That is it for my shoe collection. Now, I have something I need to show you guys. If this video hits 2,000 likes, I will go around the LA area. Now, before you all get, get wet and shit, you know, these are reps, okay? I bought these just to see what the quality difference was. I will go around the LA area, different sneaker shops, and I will make a video trying to sell these. All right, so make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. Comment down below what's your favorite pair of shoes that I have, and comment down below what favorite pair of shoes you have, or comment down below what favorite pair of shoes you want. Anyways, I will catch you in the next one, and I'll see you later. Peace. Gotta catch my breath, man. Shit. I never thought about uh, talking about shoes like this would get me fucking tired like I'm running a marathon.